Assalamu alaikum viewers, I am Naeem Shahzad and you are watching RC World YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you practical demo of replacing a capillary tube of deep freezer. So why this video till to end. Let's start the video. This deep freezer is manufactured by Waves company and I am going to show you replacing its uh, capillary tube. Here it is starting point of capillary tube and this uh, deep freezer is also start its cooling from here. If you also wanna replace its capillary tube, this video is very important for you. Just stay this video because I am going to show you full detailed video replacing capillary of this deep freezer. First of all, you have to need remove its upper sheet very carefully as I am showing you. It is very easy procedure. Just pay your full concentration and attention to this video. This is complete video. This is not incomplete video as there are a lot of channel upload incomplete videos on their channel. In this video you will see how I am removing its upper sheet, how I am installing capillary tube, how I am fixing again this sheet very clearly. Finally, you can see on your screen, I have a trace out capillary tube starting point. Yes, I have found capillary tube starting point and now I am going to cut down this capillary tube from cooling coil. Because this capillary tube has gone blocked, it is completely choked and now I will replace this capillary tube by a new one. I have a disconnected old capillary tube and now I am going to clean copper tube by using emery paper. And now I will bring it out front to me so I can easily install new capillary and I can easily breathing on this tube and capillary. Now I will also cut down its starting head by using a tube cutter. And now you can see on your screen the old capillary tube has separated from the system. Now I have installed a charging valve to this cooling coil because I am going to flush its system. It is most compulsory thing to flush its internal system before replacing a new capillary. And here I will also show you a short clip of flushing and if you want to see detailed video of flushing, I will provide a link of detailed video of flushing in this video description. You can also watch this video by going its description and clicking on that video link and now it has become neat and clean from inner side so i am going to cut down this charging valve again so i can install my new capillary tube here
and now I am preparing this capillary tube to install and I am using capillary size 0.28 and its length is about to 10 feet and here I am inserting this capillary tube in, into sleeve so it can protect from damaging. Now I have attached this capillary tube to this rod. Now I will pull it and in this way my capillary tube will reach on exact point. Now I will cut down this capillary tube from this rod and now I can open its hole very well as you can see on your screen it has opened clearly and now I will round it on this tube and I will also insert at least 2 inches capillary into this tube. It is most compulsory thing to insert this capillary tube at least 2 inches into this tube. So it cannot be blocked during brazing. And I will also pinch this tube by using a plier. Brazing has completed successfully. Now I will put it back on its exact place. Here I also request to you if you like this video kindly give it one like and also make sure to subscribe my channel inshallah you will receive this type videos regularly. And now you can see on your screen after a repacking of this sheet how it is looking. In this way you can easily replace your uh, capillary tube of deep freezer. Hope you will definitely enjoy this video. If you like it give it one like please also share with your other friends and don't forget to subscribe REC World YouTube channel for more related videos on exact time. Take care. Allah Hafiz.